Hello everyone, it's Blitz Platypus here and welcome to the Besiege build series. In today's video, I'm gonna showcase you some of these warships that I got. We have here the the BS Bullpuzzer and the Lev 05 C2 class. If you watch my previous Besiege build series and you already know that I made a poll about them, but unfortunately, I have to uh, feature these two World War II vessels this video and that video before so right now in this video we're gonna feature these warships right now this ship was equipped with uh, two auto cannons with a power of times 10 four cruise missiles which could launch vertically and four torpedoes guided torpedoes right here that could be used for hunting submarines two CWS uh, vacuum missiles right here which you can only use for about uh, two times only so which is uh, for what I'm gonna say be careful by using these guys because these guys are known to destroying its own ship two quadruple crossbow machine guns on the port and starboard side anti-ship uh, vacuum missiles right here on the stern on the top on a helicopter bay as you can see here it has a door and now we have here the Citus class right here so as you can see here she looks so simple when, when the way we look at it uh, it it, it kind of looks like some of those simple submarine we had uh, like the the lev zero one uh, just like when I featured from the previous siege hangout series but it's different because this submarine armed with four guided torpedoes and that's all. That's all she had. She got. She only got like these four torpedoes because um, the way the way I built her is to be like a very simple submarine that could be uh, mass produced, could be uh, used for many many stuff, something like that. It's like a, a cheap cheap build submarine okay so since we introduced them first so now let's hunt some surface targets now and now we're here for the submarine right here as you can see here we're submerged because in this one we're hunting down some four submarines <laughs> i know it's i say it's sur surface targets but we're do we're doing this on submerged mode but i think it's still counted as one so see here we launch our guided torpedoes right here current tow is to that one submarine right there near nearby to us and kaboom and now let's launch the second one launch that thing there go to that other submarine they're coming towards to us but we have a better torpedoes Bam! Shoot them down. And now let's go for the third one. Launch the third torpedo. Oh my god, it, it kinda rolls a little bit. But don't worry. Uh, we're gonna hit that thing off. Bam! And the last one. Launch that thing too. Launch the last one. Coming towards the fourth submarine right there. And. Kaboom. Okay, now we're done here. And now let's go. Let's go to the surface and see what would happen. Actually, I'm on a uh, Chromar map. That's why the the background was uh, cyan. And. <laughs> I know it's kind of weird, but. Anyway. Since uh, test number one is done, now let's go for the second test. Alright guys, test number two and now uh, as you see here, uh, we have here four merchant ships right there and now we're gonna ready our torpedoes right there and start go starboard side and launch that torpedo. And I tell you in this part, I kind of a little bit struggle to spot my target so as you see here, I disabled the, the torpedo a little bit here and now i found them now i'm going towards the uh, next target right there uh, it will take a while because i'm kind of a bit further away from them 
but I'm just gonna cut it right here so you won't gonna spend your time for staring this torpedo. Ah, okay, never mind. We're, we're coming towards the tor um, merchant ships and voila, she is dead. And now let's launch that second torpedo right there and uh, even go starboard side and now launch that torpedo. I'm coming towards that second merchant ship. Actually, I did a little bit of challenge with this one because uh, I tried to steer this ship so they won't get hit from the guided torpedo. So, but unfortunately, uh, I could control that them a little bit. As you can see here, they're quite a bit too near for me. So, I used my tor uh, third torpedo to strike that one ship that almost hit me. But unfortunately, I, I don't think I would survive with this one because uh, the, the debris crashed towards me and I got a little bit of bad idea to, to surface. As you can see here, we got stuck, which is a bad idea. And our fin is broken. So right now, we're going surface instead. So I just go in surface instead and just stop the engine right there. Launch the last torpedo right there and come into that last merchant ship oh my gosh he's trying trying to escape from me but not anymore you can't escape from me and now we gonna hit its port side bam clap everyone clap now let's go for the ship uh, the frigate one and now we're here for the frigate right here and we're gonna shoot down some tough boats right here we're firing our auto cannons from them and we kind of have a poor accuracy right there but don't worry um, we're sure that we could destroy this one but not that 100% but as you can see here uh, we took up its pole and we did a little bit of explosion right there nice now let's go for the second one uh, strike those strike them there we go yeah that's the a little bit of problem with this uh, ship uh, its guns are very inaccurate and I don't know why that thing exploded but still we destroyed that one and now let's go for the third one which took me a lot of time to aim because of its because of this ship's uh, poor accuracy I cannot aim it very properly you see here uh, we're, we're doing like spread shots right there and it doesn't do anything and right there I'm trying to use my uh, torpedoes but unfortunately I, I kind of forget how to use them so I just settle with the auto cannons right there yeah but in this in this part I'm very struggling very struggling right there I'm hoping that uh, there's a moment that I could hit it sorry about the motorcycle right there but still I kind of struggle to hit those uh, I mean hit that one boat so I just a little bit did a little bit of cheat there and try as uh, steer this target to towards me so I could aim it much more better. Now let's let's go shooting again. Shoot that thing again. Please shoot it again. Please shoot it again. Come on. There we go. More shooting, please. More shooting, please. More, more, more. There we go. There's a little bit of hit. Just one hit. More hit, please. More hit. There we go. Th that's more damage now. That's more damage. Yes, there we go. Explosion. Now let's go for the second one. From test number two, I make these targets to be much more further away. So right now we're gonna use our surface surface missile right there and come it towards them. And as you can see here, our missile is go going for about uh, 200 knots right there I don't know how I'm gonna translate it to kilometers but anyway it's going for about 270 knots but don't worry we're we're kind of a little bit near from that from those ships almost there and hit there I go there's a little bit of explosion there from the far distance and this one I try to be like a high higher one 
So right now we have a much more time to, to aim but in this part I I kind of bit struggled to spot my target and now I found it now. Now uh, let's go. In any minute now we're gonna strike those we're gonna strike that one boat. Just the last one boat right there. Uh, any minute now. There we go. The silhouette is, is becoming bigger. And now, thought so it's mid season. There we go. And to finish him off, but is to use the anti-ship missile, which is the vacuum anti-ship missile. But unfortunately, uh, it didn't go so very well because this ship is quite powerful and. And unfortunately, it did spot the, it did strike these ships because there's something wrong with the the rocket missile right there, and and it, it pulled us up. Okay, let's go for the third one. Test number three will be uh, the test for the uh, CWS, CIWS. Okay, I forgot. So now we we'll, we we'll launch our own uh, cruise missiles right there, and we're gonna aim it towards us. There we go, she's aiming towards us now. And this is the only problem that you need to be very fast with this one even you're in the on the low low time scale as you can see here. Yeah beautiful. She just hit that one Christmas set right there. And this is where we show the the pure problem of the ship. And you will see why. Now that our Christmas is coming towards us. And that's a problem. Uh, she can't do 90 degrees, and that one funnel blocks the the view range of the CWS. So I I guess um, I need to be a little bit better next time. So yeah, guys, that's all for now, guys. And thank you also for watching, guys. And please don't forget to like, and subscribe, and turn that notification bell so you miss a new video. But before I could end this video, for those who like to join in this. Uh, level siege tournament you only had six days left to join if you already joined just with the with the rules if you already had your design join to my discord server and send the link of your creations in the hashtag bsg sharing station where you could submit all of your cre your creations and that's all for now and goodbye people Let me get a bonus pizza.